Why can you get a student loan for college, a car loan for a car, and a home loan for a home mortgage, but you can't get a business loan? There are many intricacies involved, and there are risks associated with each and every one of them. But let's start off with a student loan. For one, it is government-backed. So that levels out the risk associated. Now, I'm not saying there won't be a default that raises it, but it counterbalances it out. And you're seeing these deferment periods and loan forgiveness happening. And it's not similar to an idle loan for business, but it somewhat is where you're looking at these deferment periods and the repayment, the forgiveness, and it is backed by the government, which helps level out that risk. And it's underneath it personally on your personal finances, personal credit. It's a bit differently associated. I can go deeper into that, but let's go to the next one. A car loan. Now, for one, you have an asset. You don't make the payments, it gets repossessed. They take it from you and they can use that equipment as collateral to make their money back or however they choose best fit. And that is something that's associated with a higher risk. And again, it is underneath you personally. Now, third, a home loan. Do I have to get into the intricacies of that and the parameters of what can happen if you don't make those payments? Your home gets taken away. Now, when we look at a business loan, why there is more risk associated with it, it's because it can either not be proven or it is proven, but it's hard to lend for your business unless you have the right type of revenue, collateral to give up to be able to secure the funding, unsecured funding just by looking at revenue. How is it credit-based personally? Do you have business credit established? If no business credit established, we may just be able to look at it underneath your personal, but it depends on the type of service. And there's more association with the risk and you may not have tangible assets within the company that you can give up so that the lender can securely get their money in return in the allotted amount of time. And this raises up the interest rates with your risk association. A lot of it is placed underneath your business rather than you if you have it set up properly and it is not a culturistic background because we're in poverty or we grew up in what people say the hood or in an economically challenged area that is not an excuse we are all resourceful we all have one way or another to come up but people like that kind of controversy and provocative type of information and going against the grain but just know that these are some of the many reasons why you can't get a business loan because you don't have the right financials you don't have the right time in business the right credit score the right revenue and there are other factors to determine on what the eligibility comes into your business not on you all solely personally like all these other ones would be like a home loan a car loan student loan they operate a bit different now i can go even deeper each into each and every one of these but i will leave it at that and if you need help getting business funding, you can come and back help. Go to the bio for much faster access and I will talk to you soon.